words of the Lord given to Susan Davis on Sunday, June 6th, 2021. This is God. I am coming. These are my words. This is God, Father of lights. I am coming. Does my word not say it? Am I not good to my word over and over? I will do as I say. I am not a man that I should lie. Those who are watching and waiting know of my coming. They see my words coming to pass. They know the hour is near because they are faithful and pursue me through truth, through my words. I have not misled anyone. I have revealed my plans through my word. Those who follow me closely know the lateness of the hour and are comforted by my spirit. Those who know me not do not have my spirit and follow the world that holds empty promises. Without a full surrender to the Father through acknowledging the high price paid by me on the cross and to receive the fullness of my spirit, then your eyes have scales and you need my eye salve to see the evil that consumes the world. Men and their plans of salvation cannot save you. Only my word and truth that is available now has the answers for what the future holds. Even men make plans many years into the future, but it is only the future that I have written and foretold that will come to pass. Why waste time on chasing after the ways of an evil world when you can be focused on that which will truly be, through my word? Your life is not promised to you in this life. You have no guarantee that tomorrow will come. Why take chances with your very soul? All choices you make are eternal whether to deny me and go to eternal hell or to surrender your all to me and receive eternal rest. Many today will receive their rewards in this life and the punishment for their bad choices for eternity. Is this how you are choosing for yourself to pursue the treasures of this life and not the treasures of the next life with your Creator? Without a relationship with me in this life, I will say that I know you not when you face me and tell you to depart. Be wise in your choices as time is short. Come to know me now as your first love. I am waiting, but not forever. There will be a time that I will bring my church home to be with me for eternity. Will you be among them? Let me write your name on my heart and put you in a place of peace even as you walk this evil earth. Now is the time of your salvation. Waiting could cost you for all time. Why take such a risk? Trust my words, my book, because those who do not walk the broad road to hell. Most who face me are unprepared and have chosen against me. Come walk by my side before it's too late. I am the Lord Eternal. Matthew chapter 13 verse 44 I counsel you to buy from me gold refined in the fire, that you may be rich, and white garments that you may be clothed, that the shame of your nakedness may not be revealed, and anoint your eyes with eye salve that you may see. Psalm chapter 17, verses 13 and 14. Arise, O Lord, confront them, bring them to their knees, deliver me from the wicked by your sword, from such men, O Lord, by your hand, from men of the world whose portion is in this life, May you fill the bellies of your treasured ones and satisfy their sons, so they leave their abundance to their children. Matthew chapter 6 verse 20 But lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven, 
where neither moth nor rust that corrupt, and where thieves do not break through nor steal. Revelation chapter 2 verses 4 and 5 But I have this against you, you have abandoned your first love. Therefore, keep in mind how far you have fallen, repent and perform the deeds you did at first. But if you do not repent, I will come to you and remove your lampstand from its place. Don't get left behind